Hi, this is Johnny. We're gonna do a title equal mini two framework update, and I will provide you the link to where to get it. Okay, it's from their website, and you just copy this and put it into the browser, and it should take you there. So once you download it, you're just going to unzip it, and we're gonna extract. Uh, Let's put it in the folder, extract to a folder. And then you're just going to copy that file into a uh, micro SD card. Now, since I don't have the the regular size micro, not micro, but SD card, I'm going to use a micro SD card. And so I'm going to take my 16 gigabyte. You don't need that big. You probably, it's a very small file. You probably could, but since I have a 16 gigabyte, I'm just going to format it. And I'm gonna format to a fat. Okay. Uh, you can format to a fat 32 prefer. Okay. And then we're just gonna put nothing here. And we can do a quick format. So okay. Uh, do you you want to format it? Yes. So once it's formatted, we going to put the SD card information in there. Let's go ahead and close this. Okay, so I'm gonna close that. And I'm gonna open up the I'm gonna look for that uh, the download that I did, which is right here, and there's the framework update. So here's the file, and I'm just going to copy it. It gave you the instruction how to do it. So you can actually look at the PDF file. And I'm just going to copy it. And the file is 218 kilobytes. So you could put it in a 2 gigabyte. You know, you know, any small size of flash drive. So now I'm going to look for my SD card, which is the K. And I'm just going to paste it. Once it's finished pacing, I'm just going to reject it. And then we're going to go to the console. Now, I've just recently bought this, and the framework is still is the older version, is one point something. And we're going to look at the framework, see what version we have, and then we're going to upgrade to a 1.1. And I recommend doing it because there's a lot of issue with the with the framework that came with it. Okay, so it's being done. We're just going to reject the SD card, and then we're going to. Uh... Okay, uh, we are in uh, Tato uh, Eagle uh, Mini Two. This is the SD card that I format to FAT32 and I'm using a 16 gig uh, SD card. So here you go, 16 gigabyte SD card. And I'm going to uh, put it into a, the reader. So micro SD card go into adapter. You could buy this anywhere from Amazon and uh, you just so I format it and I put the one file in there. So we're going to uh, put this SD card in the back. Okay. But before we do, I want to show you uh, how the button. Uh, it's very confusing because E is up here for the setting. So this this will be your A, B, C, and then this is your E. And so you just press the E for console setting. 
and you go down to the legal uh, notification and then press this A button right here to to see what version you have. So on the very top it say you have 1.02. 1 so we are going to see we could up, upgrade it to a 1.1. 1 .1. Okay. So we're going to press the B button which is the the middle button uh, to go back which is which is this button right here. And then once we finish update, we're gonna to go to reset uh, factory default and that will reset to the latest version. Okay, so you're gonna press B to get out. And so we're gonna go ahead and put, turn this machine off. Okay, we're gonna turn it off. Okay, and so once it's turned off, the machine is off, we are going to unplug this. Unplug the power, and then we're gonna turn this back on. We're gonna press it to to the right, turn it back on. Okay, so once we uh, plug it in, it's automatic going to. Uh, there's some button pressing you have to do. So we're gonna put the SD card in uh, face up. Okay, make sure you press it in and click. Okay, you click. Ouch, my finger just got. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna hold those two buttons and then we're gonna hold it, press it down. Then we're gonna press, uh, plug the power in. Okay, so now the power is on and I'm still holding the, the two button. So let me move my hand. So I'm still holding the two button, okay? Now it's saying it's checking the firmware. So we're gonna let it check. I guess you could release the button now because once it's uh once it go to the safe mode, we could we could let go it. You don't have to keep on holding it. Alright, so now it's updating the uh the firmware. And then uh, once it finished, we're gonna do one last step and then uh, we're gonna check to see what version we have. And that's pretty much it. So any of you, anybody who have one of this, uh, go ahead and go get the firmware update because they do have the, the latest version out there posted uh, from them. And that will fix all, all the problem uh, if you, you know, the problem people run into. Like bubble bubble and and some old kind of stuff. All right. So it's rebooting. And it's coming up. All right. So now we're going to press the, this button again. We're going to press the this button up here. Oh, sorry. The E button, sorry, on top. And then we're going to go to the... Uh, Let's check it. Let's check this one out first. See if it if it changed yet. Yeah, it's one point one zero now instead one point oh. So I'm gonna zoom in. So it is uh, one point one. Before it was one point zero eight. So we have updated. But there's one step that they recommend you do. B is go to reset factory setting. Okay. There's a clear. I'm going to cover the clear, but I can. But there is a factory reset. Okay, so we're going to press A. And we're going to select yes. And then press A again. And now we are factory reset, we can select English. Now, as you can notice, the sound just got louder after I factory reset it. 
So we're gonna go to, uh, we're gonna select the E again, in the middle of the, the button. We're gonna go to see if everything is okay. Press A. And you still say we in a 1.107. So we successfully uh, update the firmware and the SD card is still in there. So we could go ahead and uh, turn it off and take it out. So now when you turn it off, it, it have this loud music that you turn it off. All right, we took the SD card out, sorry. I went and turned it off and then popped the SD card out. And that's pretty much it. And those of you who bought the, I have bought this one, uh, 